You got in a fight with some Brazilians on the beach. I got robbed in Brazil on the beach. <laughs> oh, no. They told me. That, were they in their undies? Uh, no, they were just in some trunks, respectable Dang. trunks. But, yeah, they told me not to walk home on the beach by myself. And you just did? Late anyway? at night or early in the morning. I was like, late at night I could see, but I was like, early in the morning, it's sunrise. And I got robbed at right, knife point. Yeah. Damn, son, that right. must have been terrifying. Getting your ass beat by a guy in a Speedo. Yeah, it would suck. That what would did suck. you would you have to give up? Would you? It's like seven bucks. It was like seven. I had a I had like a uh, my wallet and then my or I had my credit card and then I remembered I had money like in my shoe or something. They were pissed. I'm like, oh here I have this too. They were like, kind of nice about it. Oh, that's cool. They were like, "Sorry, we're really hungry," and I was like, "Hey, thanks for not stabbing me, guys." And then, <laughs> <laughs> but I was, I was like, "Out, you get it's out of your deal. body when you're getting robbed. You're completely out of your body, and you're just like, uh." That is a, a kind of a cool way to rob someone. Sorry, we're really hungry. Yeah, they were. They we had a I had a phrase book on me and my credit card. They took they took out my credit card. I'm like, "Yo, you guys can take this to the Mac machine, just get a bunch of money out." And they were like. <laughs> They didn't know what that was, and then they took like seven bucks off me. They went through my phrase book, and they were laughing at stuff that I had circled. Oh. It, was like, it was like, "Yo, quero você." It was like, "I want you." <laughs> oh, they <knew. laughs> they were like, oh, and I was like, "Yeah, yeah." And then, yeah, it was oh, like the wow. most. It was pretty like cordial the whole experience. Wow. Damn. Yeah. They made fun of you. <laughs> they like, made fun of my phrase book. They were like, bah, they're flipping through it. When you land in Rio, you drive through the favelas. Dude. Yeah. It's so scary. And it's it's like, oh my God. Like the the level of pot. You ever see City of God? Yes. Bro, it makes Boys in the Hood look like Sesame Street. It's, yeah, it does. Dude, it's, that movie is crazy. Yeah, they're just living in sheds dude, on a hill. It's that game, what was that game you were playing? <laughs> yeah. Fallout? Where yeah. you're, like, you're like grabbing pieces of metal yeah, it's and all that's, sheet your, that's metal. your house. It's crazy. Yeah, I know a lot of people that came from there. That's nuts. Oh, yeah, all the fighters. yeah, a lot of UFC fighters came from the favelas. Dude, it's terrifying. <clears throat> yeah, it's a different level of poverty, man. And it's a different level of scarcity. Yeah. Dude, no opportunity, nothing, violence, guns. <sighs> Yeah, they come. The kids are like when you when I was walking around there, I was like twenty one, but they'll like they'll come grab your leg and like hold on to your leg and like por favor, just like dude, here's yeah, that movie that's, rules. That City of God, Oof. such a good movie. Movie so crazy, and apparently really accurate. It really is like what it's like. Damn, that was Roger Ebert days. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. When I was there, this like Swedish guy went to the favela with another guy to buy coke, and I was like. <sighs> Like, you want to come? Yo. I was like, no, <laughs> thank you. Fuck all He got that. back. He, he was like, he looked kind of like Brazilian a little bit, luckily, but I was like, bro, I'm not going with you to go there. Yeah, there's levels. Yeah. There's levels in this world. Yeah, that's a that's scary. Being that poor is scary. But it was nice. I was there. It's like Monopoly money. It's like, if it's not your currency, I was out there just oh, yeah. doling that stuff out. You it's love like, our currency. I do. We were in Australia. <laughs> Dude, we were in Australia, and Matt was like, this is USD. I tried to pay it with $20 <laughs> tried to pay in with US, US money, and they were like... <laughs> We don't take that. I'm like, come on, man. It's come like, on, man. This is 10 times your money. It's like, dude, this is American. <laughs> I'm treating them like I was in like, Honduras. I was like, yo, here's a 20 bucks. And they're like, well, we can't take this. I'm like, yeah, oh, don't give you that. That's, that's good money. Some money, have, like, they have like clear little holes in them, and there's like little holograms in it. It's all it's bullshit, like, dude. It's fake. American money is the only thing that matters. Isn't it wild, though, that no <laughs> one's sure. figured out how to completely accurately recreate money? It's just pieces of paper. Like, they had to really stay ahead of the curve. Yeah. For the counterfeiters, for the counterfeits? technology yeah, increased. True. I didn't All the printers. That. Oh, that was a major problem when this country was like starting. Yeah, we. It was yeah. an easy thing to do. By yeah. death, was punishable by death, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. They used I, to fuck you up for that. I remember the first time I ever saw a fake twenty dollar bill. I was like, oh wow, this is weird. Yeah, it's weird. It's like it feels wrong. Yeah, I don't think you can buy the paper. That's the thing. No, I think there's a specific money is a specific paper, but people bleach bills, and then you can print. You can get the real paper bleach the bill and print like tens on like a one mm. and then you can do that and sell you can sell bundles of them to people oh no kidding yeah that's what they do that's what i've heard yeah are you involved in this no i just i just <laughs> what i've heard Matt, how long have <laughs> you been doing this how long have you been no i just that? i've heard there's bad though like bad money goes around people sell it in like big chunks and you can get it in like it just seems like if they can make fake rolexes how the fuck can they not make True. fake like, cause you know they have the light they shine on the dollar bills now. Cause mm -hmm. there's like things yeah. embedded in them and stuff. Yeah, I don't know. I, but I think the people who are counterfeiting though aren't they're just kind of like, I don't know. I, it, you'd have to be so advanced technologically to like do that. And if you're able to make money, you could probably do all kinds of other stuff. Yeah, but that's the case with a lot of things that are illegal. It's like there's some industrious people that just true. go the wrong way in life, but they're really fucking <laughs> yeah. smart. That's true. I think I had some fake mushrooms oh, recently. There you go. <laughs> oh yeah official dude, same dude. man sued mr clean magic erasers <laughs> while he used matt rather mr clean magic erasers to transform one dollar bills into hundreds 
Magic erasers. So he erased it and then reprinted over it? Yeah. That's yeah. What you're supposed to clean your wall with. Mm. And that way you can get, you, you have the good paper. But then if, I guess that's why they have those uh, strips, because then you can hold up a strip and be like, that's not a $10 bill. This is a $1 bill. <laughs> that's a bill. lot of work, man. Yeah, but dude, I imagine. wonder how much money you made. You go to jail forever, son. It's the Secret Service. Protects, the Secret yeah. Service looks into this stuff. Speaking of which, what did they arrest Killer Mike for? Oh, yeah. That is uh, one of the most ridiculous. They don't arrest anybody in L.A. You got people literally yeah. doing meth in front of people's houses yeah. and tents. What did he do? And Killer Mike gets arrested after he wins three Grammys. Yeah. What did he do? Well, Jay of course, Walk. the online conspiracy <laughs> theory is Walk. that he criticized Joe Biden. That's really? The, that's the online conspi conspiracy. I of like course. that. I like that. That's a great conspiracy. That is. So, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's a fun conspiracy. Yeah, There's nothing wrong with having fun. Why, who the fuck would arrest Killer Mike? Like, what is this misdemeanor? What did he do? Did he have a, a license plate missing or something? Like, what the fuck did he do that they're... They, they didn't, they didn't release what's Killer crazy. Mike doing? Yeah. They didn't what's release killer? a charge? We're going to find out. Yeah. Killer Mike? <laughs> I guarantee you didn't do Killer Mike? Yeah, you think he did something? He's such a right? good guy. Killer Mike. As brilliant as he is, that is the name of like a crazy thug. Yeah, yeah. That's True, not yeah. the name of a guy who's like a philosopher. Yeah. Killer Mike, yeah. yeah. Killer Mike is like a Killer Mike's not even a creative name. Leader. It's like a name that's like yeah. <laughs> the dumb guy in the neighborhood. They're like, oh, that's Killer Mike. Killer Mike. Fuck yeah. away from that guy. <laughs> this um, is from, this is an hour ago. He said nothing happened, but this is the official report. It mm -hmm. says uh, a physical altercation happened. Oh, <clears throat> and he uh, was okay. Then released uh, misdemeanor battery and then released on zero bail. Oh, he bitch slapped somebody. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of rules. That's awesome. But again, in Los Angeles, there's people that are like literally pulling knives on sheriffs and being out of jail like, yeah. that day. Yeah, he did One of the what guys that Will attacked, Smith did uh, at the trail <laughs> ward. At the ward, <laughs> yeah, yeah. right. In front of the if, whole world, yeah. and he gets arrested. Yeah, that's bizarre. So you think it's like post Will Smith? They've changed the rules. Maybe, maybe. Whenever yeah. <laughs> celebrities smack each other, you have to step in right away. Yes. <laughs> Might be a new task force for that. Well, it depends on who he smacked. You know, true. That's the question. Yeah. Right. If it's somebody we want him to smack. Yeah. You know, now I'm now I'm really irritated. Yeah. You know, if he smacked Taylor Swift, that would be a real issue. That would yeah, be. You don't yeah. Put yeah. your hands on our queen. <laughs> Not after last night. She had. She uh, didn't. She do well last night. I saw the news. She did a lot in the Grammys. Things something. are going well for Taylor I Swift. Find Taylor Swift it, is doing all right. I find it so fascinating how many people are, for whatever reason, are opposed to it. They don't like that she's so popular. I don't it's really, it. Uh, it's normal. It's normal human behavior. Well, she's ruining the game of football now. I can't watch she's it. I can't even watch it. That's the new thing. She's ruined. She has ruined the game of football. I can't even watch it anymore. Listen, because <laughs> it cuts to her once or twice. And it's every time during the game, her, like, and I see her, and I go, "Mother, why do you care?" <laughs> Thank you.